Hey everybody, it's Rob Nazarian with Talk Android, and we're here with the uh, No app, and uh, it's going to be preloaded on the uh, Galaxy Note 10.1, and it's all about uh, textbooks for uh, K-12 and uh, even college students. Uh, and I have Thomas here, it's going to show us a little bit about it. Thank you so much for having me today. So what we have here is the main page. This is your course manager where you can see all of your textbooks. We have nine here and a couple sample books as well that come and explain how to use the app. I want to show you today some of the cooler features that we have going on. So I'm going to open up this book by tapping on it and it should expand. And when I open it up, it should go to something called Gallery View, but I've opened this book a few times today, so it'll just load on a page. Um, you'll see that I have already created highlights here and bookmarks that you can go to and find your content easily. So let me go back to a different page and create a highlight for you. So I'm starting here. I simply drag the pen down. There's my highlight. Change colors depending on what I'm in the mood for, or you can see that there's different things so that you can keep a reference for yourself. Besides that, we have some sticky notes where you can type and add any content that you need. And the really cool part that I'm about to get to is our 3D models and whatnot. So right here, we have our smart links is what we call them, where you can play videos, which are given to us by the publisher and we add into the book. So you can start a YouTube video. Uh, the network here is a little slow sometimes. So. Yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> so we have this going on right here, given by the teacher or the publisher. You can even add your own in here, and besides that, one of our best features is our 3D models, where you can interact with these models and play with them and touch and move them however you want. Yeah. And so I'll close that. And last but not least, we have our journal feature, um, where you can go ahead and see all the highlights and bookmarks that you've made in the book. Um, images is important, you can save all that content in one place that's easily accessible for studying for your tests. And of course we do use the we do use their pen to the max. Uh, so I'll show you right here. If you tap on this we get our pen notes where you can circle diagrams. As you saw during the demo earlier, you can switch the colors, we can change the type of pen. Let's go ahead and make this a green so it's very visible. Highlights, colors, stuff like that. And when you exit out of it, it all goes away. So you just enter it to pull it back up. And if you don't want to do that, we have a little section down here where you can, it's always visible. And you can share, I guess, some of your annotations and stuff with yeah. other people I was reading on yes. the first release? We're coming out with our 3.0 version of the application that's going to have this share feature where you can have a publisher. Uh, let me go ahead and show it. This one actually has it installed right now. Uh, some of our devices here today are on the older version. So what we can do is this one is set up as a user who subscribed to a publisher. Publishers can create content so they can go ahead and select a book. They can select what material specifically in that book to share and then share it with classrooms and students. And students can actually go ahead and sign up to subscribe to the publisher as well. And when they do that, they can see the publisher select notes and highlights and stuff in a read, sort of read view. That's pretty cool. Wow. Yes. So you'll be able to share. I mean, students could even use this to chat in class if they wanted to and a lot of things like that. So that's going to be really neat to see coming out. Um, so it is, it is out, but we just don't have too many models to yep. show you today. Sure. Yeah. What kind of uh, average is there an average price point for the books? Uh, does it probably vary or? Uh, it's extremely varied, uh, just because we have K through 12 books and college books. We do sell just some normal reading books. Mm -hmm. um, 9.99 or less for K through 12. Yeah, 9.99. 9 .99? For K wow, 12. that's really good. Yeah, so we have a special catalog just for those ones, and then the college level textbooks. Those are the more varied. And, and you have about 200,000 books. Yes. Exactly. And Great. They, and they vary the. the College books are 30 to 50 percent cheaper than standard books. Yes, great. Because we get that electronic going. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, thank you very much, guys. And You're this welcome. This is the first uh, launch on the preload. Is the first time No is on an Android device. Okay. So Has it been on uh, it's iOS? Been on iPad oh, and, I right, okay. and okay. on uh, the web. And then this is the first Android device. What exactly do you call it? Just call it No, or do you call it the No app, or what do you exactly um, do you call it? Refer it to either. So the okay. company is No, yeah, and yep. then it's the No app textbook app. No textbook app. Yeah. The No textbook app. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I yeah. say that most. Uh, you want, do you want to go to that main page? You could show them how the where the what do you want where just the no icon on the in the app store you know that is preloaded. Oh, um, sorry. Like oh, you mean in like a, you mean uh, in the oh, yeah. uh, launcher right. in the launcher? Yeah, right there. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Right there. Okay. Very good. Well, thanks a lot, guys. You're welcome. Thank you.